if you're looking to add power to your surf, there's a certain biomechanical principle that you have to follow. And in most cases, club players or junior players are not doing it right. What happens oftentimes is that you're too focused on engaging your upper body to hit the ball. So when you're serving, you're just thinking about using your upper body or trunk, you want to go down, you want to think about the arm, you're hitting down, and so you're mostly engaging the muscles from your waist up. And so what we see oftentimes is a serve where the legs are in one direction and then the trunk is in a different direction. And I call that like the body is a little bit broken. And when the body is a little bit broken like this, Uh, the muscles don't connect well and the energy doesn't flow well through the body. And so we have to find a way to correct that. Because if you observe really top players, you will see that at the point of contact, their body is completely straight. So there's like a straight line from the racket through the body to the leg. So I'm going to show you a few exercises on how to feel what is connected body and how this gives you more power on your serve. A very fun drill to do to feel what I'm talking about, which is the connected body, is the one I call kill the fly. So if you imagine uh, there's a fly on the fence high there and I have this towel and I want to swat the fly, then what would you do? So what you would do is probably be something like this. So as you can see, I'm just trying to reach high up and swat the fly on top of the fence. And what I do when I'm doing that, I'm just trying to focus my energy up there into one small point. And so if you watch how I do it, I'm not trying to go through, I'm just trying to focus the energy up. And so the common mistakes mistake when people are serving is that they think too much down. They're focusing their energy down and they spread their energy through a large area rather than, than think up and focus energy into the ball. The ball will go off the racket whether you aim it down or not aim it down it will fly off the racket and so what's really important is that you connect your body and when you do that this you will see that you connect your body very naturally and you will straighten up your body and you will feel this tension going th through your back and through your buttocks and through your leg down to your heel and you will feel this tension coming through your body and this is where you connect your body and feel the energy flow. So I'll show you one more exercise how to feel that. So the second exercise where you can feel the connected body is when you push with the racket to the fence and you try to use your whole body, so you try to tighten up your body a little bit and you go on your toes and you will feel that your leg is tense also and your, your lower back and your back and you try to feel this line, so you try to feel this line coming from your shoulder and then through your back and to your leg, so like diagonally. And you want to push into the fence and feel this energy. So feel this little tension, little tightness. And so you can try again and you just come up and focus your energy, try to firm up your body from your heel. You see I go on my toes so it forces me to automatically tighten up these muscles and then they will connect. They will help me connect the body and send energy through my body. And so I just press here with my with my wrist, I press the racket face in the fence and I tighten up and I just do that a few times to feel what it means connected body and then I will do the same when I'm serving the ball. So the last drill I suggest you do is to hit the ball and try to feel this line, this connected body and don't try to hit into the court because that will slow you down but just try to hit the ball really far or really fast and just focus on 
focusing energy into the ball, so heating up and trying to feel this connected body, so it's not just your upper part serving, but it's actually the whole body, this whole connection from your heel to your hand. So here's, here's one demo.